Welcome to the DHL Daily Highlights of the HSBC World Rugby 7 Series from Dubai, Day 2. After a day of intense competition in the searing heat of the desert, Pool A in the women's competition looked like this, with series leaders USA and Canada a win apiece. Reigning Olympic champions Australia and Spain sat atop Pool B, while standings in Pool C saw New Zealand and France ahead of England and Japan. Spain against Fiji to open day two. <laughs> Garcia, time to tell the referee her opposite's offside before she passes the ball. And now on the angle, Lita Abina with a little fend. She ran a brilliant line, got the pass. But it came from the turnover there from Spain. They stayed patient in defence. 19 points apiece. Australia will fancy themselves one more here to finish off. Good performance. Oh, opening up, just so much space, way too much space for the Australians, slipping out of tackles, Faith Nathan, the teenagers having a whale of a time in the desert, Faith Nathan scores the final act from Australia, a comprehensive performance, 38 points to 5, Australia over Ireland, Fiji hold them out, whoa, once more, that's the way to do it, lane is cut in half, G off the back of a big hit might go 80 metres to finish it off. It'll be a big run to the end, but it's the tackle that steals the show. Fiji 28, Island 12. Really well connected. These new players. Oh, the ball in the hands. Hannaway had no right to get it away. Nathan clung on. Crazy, Georgia Hannaway takes it into contact, somehow gets that flick away, but to regather that in one hand, Faith Nathan, well done. 38 points to five, take out their third straight win. Coming up right now, it's Canada against Brazil, number six v number 12. Goes back into Lucan. Wonderful work to keep it alive, and there she is again, popping up, the right time, the right place. Bianca Ferreira, two doubles in two games. And then just a series through the hands, but that line picked off perfectly by, once again, Bianca Ferreira. Final score here, dominant Canada defeat Brazil by 43 points to nothing. Hold. Thomas reaches to the heavens with that. As Doyle goes on the angle, it's Kelta! She'll cut you like a pair of scissors! Oh, what a line, completely cuts against the green. That's exact, that's textbook. It's the United States, they get the job done here against Russia by a score of 53 points to 14. Chance here for Russia, big overlap, all they've got to do is shift it. Opportunity for the score and they're there, it's Dan Nilova. Russia have come from behind to beat Brazil here by 22. Points to seven. And they go the same way. Gestaitis. And Ember bumps off the Canadian defender. Cheetah Ember. Rambunctious play. And then the just sheer power by Cheetah Ember to finish it off. Look at that. Sit down. 34-10. <laughs> the USA have beaten Canada. So coming up next, the fourth seeds, France, up against the Invitational side here in Dubai, Japan. Counter up from France, and they win it. Okemba, bit of footwork. Seraphine's away again. It's actually Nasira Konde. Nasira Konde, fresh off the bench. What a way to in inject yourself in this match. France had their second win of the tournament they've beaten japan here by 21 points to seven into the hands of broughton gail broughton she offloads to stacy walker and the skill here gail broughton just a little show and go commits the last defender and a nice little offload to stacy walker who bags a double they've beaten england here by 40 points to 12. 
And now Fisher never stopping Heather Fisher from there. She put out the big fin, didn't even really need it. Too strong, Heather Fisher for England. She's there in support, always on hand. It will not be enough for them to get through to the quarterfinals here in Dubai. England 31, Japan 14. Flirt with disaster in their own goal line. Oh, what a ball for Okemba. Are you kidding? How did she get that away? New Zealand will chase, but it's clean, clear territory ahead for Serafine Okemba. Off the ball by Coralie Bertrand. The effort, the energy, the hustle from France. 19-14, they beat the defending champions. And we have a look at the Pool A standings. USA beating Canada to take top spot in their group. Those two teams going through to the quarterfinals, along with Russia as the best third place team. In Pool B, Australia, perhaps the most impressive of all comers so far this weekend. And Fiji into a quarterfinal for the first time in over a season. Spain will also sneak through as one of the best third place sides. And looking in at Paul C, France top the group ahead of New Zealand. England and Japan will have to be satisfied with the minor places. Well, let's have a look then at how our matches will play out on the final day. The quarterfinals will see Australia against Spain. France, Canada should be a beauty. Fiji, New Zealand and USA, Russia.